What I usually do is I boil it for a few minutes, get it a little soft, and then I finish it up in the microwave. Just take your little sweet potato right there, cut it right in half. Now if I had some salt, I would just, which I do, a little bit of salt, just take a little bit of salt, sprinkle a little bit in there, just a little bit, about a quarter of a teaspoon, give it a little bit of flavor. Take some butter. Uh, some kids like to load it with butter. I like to load mine with butter. Put some little notches in there so the butter soaks in. Like I said, oh, a lot of butter. Put a little bit of uh, cinnamon on top of that. Just sprinkle a little bit. And then, to finish it off, hey, nothing like some marshmallows. When I saw this at the Texas Roadhouse restaurant, I said to myself, this is the way I am always making my sweet potatoes from now on. Now, if you got a real hot fudge, or some uh, caramel after you melt the marshmallows it's not too bad to put hot fudge and or caramel and just drip it over it uh, it comes out really good uh, if you want to to make it a little sweeter you can add some sugar under it I usually use Splenda uh, I really don't like anything that has sugar on it. Uh, let's see here, how about 44 seconds? That should do it. And we'll just cook it up. And wait for the marshmallows to melt. And they're already starting to melt. And there they go, they're melting. I'm melting! I'm melting! Wizard of Oz. <laughs> Just a quick little snack. It's a nutritious snack for kids. And as you can see, you got your marshmallows there. Like I said, if you got some caramel or hot fudge, just drip that over it. And wow, yummy. So enjoy. Just a quick snack. Give your kids a lot of fiber, a lot of vitamin A, good amount of potassium. It's a nice little nutritious treat. Enjoy. Till next time.